Microsoft Edge was first released back on April 29, 2015. At that time, it was primarily meant to replace the age-old Internet Explorer. Sadly, because of the domination of Google Chrome on the desktop browser market, it was used only to download Chrome. However, on January 15, 2020, Microsoft changed the strategy and instead of going up against its rival, it adopted a new Chromium-based design for Edge, which is also the basis for Google Chrome. After that, it gained huge popularity and according to StatCounter, Edge had captured 8.84% of the market share as of August 2021 from a mere 0.02% in January 2020. While Google Chrome still holds the first position by capturing 66.94% market share, many users are shifting towards Edge because of its additional features and improved privacy. So naturally, the question arises, does Edge have an edge over Chrome? In today's video, we are going to take a look at both of these browsers and we'll tell you which one is better for you. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Two of the browsers share lots of similarities as well as some differences. And it's important to discuss them first so that you can have a clear idea on which one to choose from. First of all, interfaces on both of these browsers are almost the same. Many of the old school design from the Edge has gone, replaced with a clear and easy to use interface. The search bar, extension and settings option are in the same place which means you will not face any problems while switching to any of these. Both use the same rendering engine based on the open source Chromium project. However, Chrome uses Google as its default search engine while Edge uses Bing. But both can be changed to your preferred search engines in the settings option. The basic features are also the same. On the home page, you will find all the essential Office apps like Microsoft Word, Office, Outlook, and all the Office 365 apps. Chrome, on the other hand, lets you access all the Google apps like Docs, Drive, Gmail, and all the other workspace apps. But Edge also has some extra features like Vertical Tab, which gives you more space to easily keep track of all the open tabs. In addition, Immersive Reader helps you to focus more when you're reading something, and there are also options like Read Aloud, Editor, and more that are not present in Chrome. So feature-wise, Edge has an advantage over Chrome. Extension support for any application plays a crucial role in terms of desktop browser popularity. And moving to the Chromium platform opened the possibilities of extension support for Microsoft Edge. Microsoft's store extension collection is continuously growing. And if an Edge user wants to download an extension that is only available on Chrome Web Store, that is also possible by following some simple methods. However, Chrome Web Store still remains robust when it comes to quantity. Now, in terms of performance, both actually perform really well. They're both fast browsers, but one of the complaints that many people have is that Chrome is a resource-hungry browser, which means it uses lots of RAM. And using various benchmarking tools also proves that to be true. Edge does use less RAM and performance seems slightly better than Chrome, although the difference is going to be negligible for most of the users. Syncing on Google Chrome is on another level as it can sync almost all the things across platforms when you add your email ID to the browser. It handles syncing flawlessly between your phone, tablet, laptop and any other device where Chrome can be installed. Edge can also sync passwords, bookmarks and more from device to device but frankly, it's not perfect. It's because Edge is relatively new to the development process and needs time to perfect this. So as of now. Google has the upper hand here. To protect users against phishing and malware, both the browsers notify users when they land on an HTTP page instead of an HTTPS page, letting them know that the traffic is unsafe. But Chrome wins out because of its frequent security updates than Edge. With these updates, Chrome eliminates possible vulnerabilities in its code. The major problem with Chrome is the privacy issue. 
We all know that Chrome is developed by Google, which is a company that relies heavily on advertising for revenue. And for that, it keeps track of all the users' data and search results to show relevant ads when they browse the internet. Microsoft, on the contrary, offers free modes protection from tracking and gives you three options to choose. All things considered, it is safe to say that Edge has better privacy, performance, and some additional features which users will find helpful, whereas Chrome has a robust extension support, syncing capabilities, and frequent security updates. So, if you're concerned about your privacy and don't want your browser to keep track of all your activities, switching to Edge can be a smart decision. But if you're more inclined to Google's ecosystem, then sticking with Chrome might be the best option for you. So that was all about the Edge vs Chrome and which is better for you. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.